So a few reasons why we might want to get awake blood pressures on our lions here at Zoo Atlanta. Number one, to develop therapeutic protocols for lions living with age-related chronic diseases. A second reason is that by comparing awake versus anesthetized blood pressures, this is going to help us choose appropriate anesthetic protocols for our individual lions. And number three, obtaining these blood pressures will eventually help us develop a baseline for non-domestic felids. Once Farasi is shifted into the holding area, keepers will ask him to station on a bench. They'll give me the go-ahead to move in. I'll wrap a blood pressure cuff around Farasi's tail and ask the machine to get us a blood pressure reading. This study was done every two weeks for a period of six months. Usually we'll get a blood pressure reading either once, twice, or three times during one training session. The keepers will consistently reward him for his good behavior, either with one of his favorite treats, which is raw meatballs, or positive verbal rewards. After we're done getting the blood pressure reading, the keepers will let me reward for Rossi myself. And then they will shift him outside and let him go on about his day. In keeping with Zoo Atlanta's training via positive reinforcement, the Lions always have the choice of participating or not. 